Hello and welcome back to the Renegade Gamers channel. I am the Renegade Gamer and we're playing Resident Evil 3 Blind. I'm debating on uh, whether or not to take a healing herb. I'm pretty sure I can get by Nemesis. So we're gonna we're gonna risk it. If I die, I die. No big deal. Oh wow, he didn't show up. Okay. All right. So apparently that was just strictly in the demo. That area. In that case, I want to re-equip my gun. Well, I guess we get to see what's over here now. Oh, there's the bolt cutters. And a box. Um... Is someone in here? Well, they can stay in there. Because what I'm interested in is a shotgun and equipment. Oh, another fancy box. Okay. So we can also get whatever else is in there. If it's a jewel. Yep, it's a jewel. Cool. Alright. First aid spray. And is the gunpowder sir? Yes it is. Anything else? Don't look like it. Alright, so that changes up things a little bit. What we'll do is we'll holy crap. That's new. Fuck it, Hank, you can't get to us. He's over there. And I ran right into him. Ah, get off. It's okay, I'm just gonna make it back, so. Uh, we are hurting, so we'll go ahead and use it. What do we get? Ooh! Gun parts. For the tactical shotgun. Okay. Nice. So we'll store that up then. Also, I want to go down here because uh, I want to see if Mikhail has something new to say. In the demo, he had something new to say. Uh, I didn't ever actually show it off. I'm just curious uh, if he does it down here now. Sent Carlos to clear rubble from tracks. <laughs> Gives him a chance to clear rubble from his brain. <laughs> <coughs> Alrighty then. Sorry, just taking a quick drink before we get started. Alright, so we are fully healed. We have bolt cutters, we got grenade, we got large gunpowder, so we are going to go back for shotgun. Uh, try and think of all the stuff you can break with the bolt cutter. Notice that. This was there. Yeah, 
Anyway, we'll drop off uh, the large gunpowder and a grenade for the time being. Because we shouldn't need it. I'll take the long way around just to avoid him. Ah! Dodged one, hit the other. And now we got the cop that's crawling around out here, so I gotta be wary of him. Pardon me, pal. Is there one fewer zombie out here? I feel like there is. Uh, actually, we can go over here and, well, we can pick the shotgun up first. There we go. Ah, the beautiful, beautiful head popper. Now we're talking. Yep, still there. Come on over, asshole. Goodbye. Alright, he's dead. Pop this guy. I think he's dead. Yeah, okay. Oh, there's three of them back here now. Hello. Goodbye. I'll be taking those. And a handgun ammo will be much appreciated. Oh yeah, is that bobblehead up here? No, okay. So no bobblehead here. Got it. And, uh, no, that is not all the uses of the... I still got some uses, apparently. Good to know. Okay. Actually, we're good. Pretty decent to go, so let's just go ahead and make our way over there. Pardon me? Coming through. Is that zombie yet? Oh, he's all the way over there. Okay, so now we can kind of move stuff around. Alright then, uh, we'll put the shotgun up for the time being. Grenade. Shells. And we'll save. There we go. Some fresh supplies. I'm still in fairly good health. Let's see what's in here. Uh, 
Do you be see us? Yeah, careful, careful. Come on, don't look at me like that, all right? I'm not an effective expert. No, 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 wait, please! No. What the fuck? He was infected. He might have been infected. Oh, stars, this soft. No wonder so many of you dead. And what are you, UBCS, killing your own people? He would have turned. There's your sense of self-preservation. Go back to the subway station. We don't need a bleeding heart like you getting in the way. What an asshole! Fairly certain I know who that is, too. <laughs> Hold on. USB... UBCS suicide note, September 28th, Middle East, Eastern Europe, East Africa. I thought I knew what hell was. Figured I'd never crack, no matter what was thrown at me. But this job? The one that was supposed to be easy? A quick wage? I'd earned it? It all happened at once. There were 30 guys in our squad, all armed with state-of-the-art assault rifles. And yet we were wiped out in less than 48 hours. I've been through uh, sh enough shit to know it uh, it only gets even worse, if that's just the beginning. Maybe I'm a coward, I don't care. This is the only way I have left. I just hope my body doesn't get back up after I pull the trigger. Jeez. Blew his head, blew his brains out. This is a wide area. Electricians notice. Public use generators provided by Raccoon City Electricians Guild. Due to the ongoing power outages, the guild has decided to provisionally place a number of electric generators throughout the city. Remember, or sorry, everyone is welcome to use them. But remember, these generators are running high voltage currents. If one were to be struck by struck or impacted by gunfire, anyone standing nearby could be electrocuted. Handwritten addition. You got that? If you see a generator spitting sparks, don't go near it. Don't do anything stupid. Safety first, as the saying goes. If we make it through this mess, I'll have plenty of busted generators for sale at bargain prices. Your neighborhood electrician, Sam. See where to go. So I do not want to deal with him. Ah! Fuck! God, I hate zombie dogs. Shit! Whoa! Let's see if I can get a better shot on him. There! Got him. Why would I be discarding an item? Oh. Okay, apparently I don't need that anymore. Y'all can fuck right off. Damn lock pick up. Need it. Ah. Kinda wish I hadn't left my knife behind now. Well, we did, so I'll just have to deal. One. Oh, 
shit! Fuck! That could have went better. Oh, come on, man! And I'm dead. <sighs> All right. Well, first death. See where it puts us at. Okay, so... I could go back here and grab that. At least we killed the dogs. Dogs are always a hit or miss with me. I do not like the zombie dogs uh, in Resident Evil. I admit that freely, but the thing is is that 99% of the time, they really are hit or miss. Sometimes they're really easy to put down, then you have dogs like in Resident Evil 5. <laughs> That's the problem. Uh, we'll bring the shotgun with us. That way we just cap some heads. And I will hold off on saving just yet. Or uh, doing anything of that matter. Alright, so we're going to be blowing some brains off. Hopefully find another uh, hit pouch or something. Watch as the sandwich goes down the street. Are the ham on right? Anyone? Hey, how are you? Come closer, please. Goodbye. You're next. Goodbye. Come on down to the party, pal. Red herb. We can mix that with the green herb. Facts from the substation chief. To all employees, in response to the violent outbreaks across the city, we've implemented an international power outage, or an intentional power outage. Do, once the situation has been brought under control, please activate the four breakers ASAP. Once that's done, turn the main power switch in the control room to reactivate the power grid. So four main, four breakers... Oh, hit pouch. Thank God. Well, apparently there's something else in there I missed. What do we miss? Getting organized. Oh, it's in order to lockers. Oh, wait. There is a couple of lockers we can open, though. Anything over here we can use? No. Alright, so I'm telling you, whenever we get that lock pick, <laughs> we're going to do some picking. Alright, then. Since I can do that. Yeah, we'll hold up. We'll go ahead and bring out some extra shotgun shells. We'll mix that with this. That way we at least got a healing item on us. <coughs> um, see, the thing is, is, I don't know if I want to combine this, because I don't know if it's going to take up two slots afterwards. 
Okay, good. Still takes one slot. All right, so I got five slots open. We'll go ahead and save. All right, let's go see what's going on here. We got to hit four, what was it, four levers? Herbs. They work. I was starting to look like Chet is was starting to look like Chet was never going to come back from his rounds. So I poked my head in there and fuck me. Next thing I know, I got some kind of maggot squirming down my throat. I was gagging and heaving, but those little bastards didn't seem to mind none. They just wouldn't let up, come up. I was staggering around like a madman. Then I saw it, a green herb. My grandma once told me that green herbs are a natural bug deterrent. So I grabbed one, shoved it down my gob, and swallowed. And what do you know? Little things didn't want to be in there anymore. I've never been so happy to throw up. I'm going to head back uh, out there to look for Chad. If anyone sees this, remember, eat your greens. the hell? Oh God, what the hell? Oh my God. The fuck? Substation internal memo. Memo. Uh, the key to the high voltage area has gone miss missing, and the earliest we'll be able to get a replacement is in next is next week. And in turn, a lockpick will be provided to the senior employee on duty. We only have one lockpick and cannot afford to lose it. So please keep it in its carrying case at all times when you're not using it. And please could you check just once more that you did not accidentally take the key home. If you happen to find it, please bring it to Kate in the administration. Wait a minute. Does this have the lot picked in it? Oh my god, we got lock picks. Well, we'll be back to this. I'm gonna go back and fucking scavenge. <laughs> I got a chance to go scavenge stuff, so let's go take said opportunity. Uh, let's see, we'll drop off the herbs. Uh, we'll leave that. We'll just take that. I think we'll be fine with four shotgun full of four shells. Uh, somebody then went through and sweeped up the bodies. Look at that. Oh yeah, there we go. Now we're talking. Let's start doing some real scavenging here and get some stuff. By the way, I haven't mentioned it yet. Uh, I I am enjoying the music quite a bit. It's a lot more atmospheric, uh, or rather, it's nice to have music in the in the game. 
The uh, second game season was a little, a little bit too atmospheric for my taste. Not bad, just atmospheric, so. Okay, first stage break, nice. Carry that with us. Let's see. I think we can get this done without him hitting us. There we go. Okay, no, he can't come in. All right, that's fine. Uh, Bobbling Head Dolls, your Charlie doll. Uh, the original Charlie doll was based on the likeness of Toy Uncle's founder, Charlie McBurgan, and it's become the mascot for the com company. We are pleased to present this porcelain Charlie doll as a celebration of our 25th anniversary. Individually handcrafted with love and care by our staff, the limited edition item makes for a precious gift. We hope he'll find his place as a cherished member of your family. Caution, this product is extremely fragile. Take care not to drop it or strike it. Mega Man reference. Is that a Ghost and Goblins reference? Because Arthur's from that. Oh, can you not get back there? What's in the box? Ah, oh, another jewel. Cool. Huh, I guess that's all there is here. Boy, he's just standing there at the door, isn't he? Alright, well, we'll have to give him a nice haircut. So... There you go. Matter of fact, fuck it. Get him out of the way, too. Okay. I know I'm being a little liberal with the weaponry here. But I got some extra ammo, so I'm not really that concerned about it at the moment. I may regret my decisions later. Oh, another hit pack! Awesome! Well, that was fucking worth it. Uh, yeah, we can go. We can continue exploring around a little bit more. Uh. We'll put that up. And we'll go get the other couple items we left behind. Uh, wow, you're still alive. Take a hint, dude. I'm surprised that shotgun blasted, not kill this guy. Yeah, we're gonna run this way just so he doesn't grab us. He is alive. Okay, so where are the two places I'm missing? Oh shit, I didn't know. I forgot to get the damn lock in there. Ah! Come on, Renegade, you're making mistakes, man.
At least I ain't gotta worry about these two anymore. I'm already seeing how you could uh, cut down some time, though. But, first playthrough, I want to see where everything is. Okay, shotgun shells. Nice. Worth coming back for. And I think that just leaves the donut shot, right? And, uh... Power station? Yeah. So we'll quickly make our way to those two locations. Oh, another hand grenade. Nice. And... Where is it? Well, I'm not glad I blew that guy's head off. it in here? Yes. What do we get? Oh, another first day's for Nice. There's a box in here. More shotgun shells. All right. So we have looted everything. Okay. Good to know. Looted everything. We got some more ammo. We got some felt spray. Two more... Uh, hip pouches. <laughs> I'd say we're pretty good for business at the moment. Now I just gotta make my way back. Pardon me. Give me a wide breath, berth there. Okay, that's just the light. Ah, you can't get to me. Y'all are all stuck. Wait a minute. Okay, no cop in a car. Good. No cop in that car. All right. Now that we successfully raided everywhere and scavenged uh, a bunch of stuff. Curiosity. One last thing. I'm fixing to end the episode. I just want to check something.
Okay, they still have use. I don't know where to... Alright, well, we're going to go ahead and get in here and we're going to save. So, leave that behind. And... Where's our shotgun at? Okay. Yeah, we're going to save. Alright, then that's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, when we return, we will make our way down into the uh, whatever that is down there that is in there. So, I'm having fun with this. <laughs> Believe it or not. Um, so anyway, I'll catch y'all next time. Till then, y'all take it easy.